Hi friends, welcome back to my channel, Jorge the Explorer, and welcome to this new video. How are you all doing? I know life is not always hungry dory, right? We all face some sort of issues, challenges in life, uh, whether it is uh, emotionally, physically, mentally, or sometimes financially, right? We all face some problem, some sort of problems, issues, and uh, we face them, we overcome them, and come victorious. That's life, right? So. Today we are going to explore a couple of more places in South Mumbai. We had been to Chani Road and surrounding areas last week. And today we are going to explore marine lines and uh, surrounding areas like uh, uh, Kalba Devi and uh, all these places. This Kalba Devi is one of the interesting places in Mumbai. And right now I'm in Marine Drive. Okay, Marine Drive and Marine Lines. Marine Lines is the area and Marine Drive is the it's the seaside of Marine Lines, it's called Marine Drive. I'm at Marine Drive right now. I think I've shown you Marine Drive Promenade in my previous videos. Okay, so still I'll show you a little glimpses of Marine Drive because it's one of the popular places in South Mumbai. And uh, okay, uh, we are going to start uh, today's video from Marine Drive. Okay, so please stay tuned. And first, this is the Marine Drive Promenade. And you can see the beautiful Marine Drive Promenade. You can see the Mumbai skyline. Amazing Mumbai skyline from here. And uh, this uh, particular area becomes so vibrant and uh, beautiful after sunset. I'm at the wrong time. You have to come after sunset to explore this place. And uh, this is the wrong time. So, okay. And uh, now I'm going to cross this road. Crossing Mumbai's roads is always a challenge. <laughs> this is a heavy traffic. And uh, now, friends, I, I ended this uh, beautiful lane opposite Marinda Promenade. It's a beautiful street with uh, full of trees and residential buildings on both sides. You can see the parking area. It's full of cabs and uh, private vehicles parking on the sides. It's a beautiful street and a heading further uh, and the sea. What else is for here? And friends, this line is, uh, this street is close to the Marine Lines Railway Station. You can see the railway track from here. And uh, I cross the railway bridge and enter the other side now. Okay. And uh, this one, cobbler sitting here, this is a normal site. How are you, brother? It's good. How much do you earn in a day? I can't tell you. I'm going to buy it. It's also 200, 300, 400. It's more than that. 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 Where are you from? I'm from Maharashtra. Maharashtra? Maharashtra? Yes. Okay. 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 I'm in the South Car. Thank you. Okay, I just uh, asking how much he earns per day. He says three to four hundred rupees, sometimes five hundred rupees per day, depends on the client. <laughs> okay. And uh, he said uh, three to four hundred rupees, sometimes five hundred rupees per day. It's a very less in a city like Mumbai. This is how Mumbai is. Poverty and luxury exist, coexist. <laughs> okay. And uh, support puri of so many things. That's Mumbai. Okay, now heading for the, uh, heading to the railway station now. Uh, Mumbai, sorry, Mar Marine Lines railway station. Okay. And friends, this is the flyover bridge uh, next to the railway station, Marine Lines railway station. You can see several residential buildings all around. Big and small. Big towers and uh, small buildings everywhere. Old and new. And friends, this is the view from this flyover. You can see the heavy, very heavy traffic below. And friends, I'll uh, pan my camera around and show you the entire area. Okay. 
Okay. Just let you know I'm at the other side of this radio station, Marine Lens radio station. I'm heading further, and uh, my next uh, destination is Kalba Devi and Princess Street. It's very close by. Okay. Friends, you can see several heritage buildings on the side. Very old building, hundreds of years old, hundreds of years old, with uh, several businesses running on the ground floor, like uh, banks and financial institutions, and several uh, various types of shops. These are very old, hundreds of years old heritage buildings. Now, uh, heading further. And friends, right now I'm in this uh, place called uh, Princess Street, very close to Marine Lake Station. And of course, one of the popular landmarks here is Parsi Dairy Farm. It's a century old establishment started by one Mr. Nariman Hardashir, a Parsi gentleman and businessman. In 1916, over 107 years old establishment. I'll show you that. And uh, this dairy is popular for high quality milk and milk products like uh, butter, ghee, cheese and uh, of course various types of seeds. So we're going to explore this place first of all, okay? And uh, let's see what are the delicacies available right now, okay? The friends, this is the popular, very popular Parsi Dairy Farm in Princess Street, Marine Lines. Now I have to cross this road. Okay, it's <laughs> so risky. Okay, I will cross this road now. Yes, I made it. This is Parsi Dairy Farm. It's so popular. Hundreds and hundred and seven years old uh, establishment, so popular and so popular for genuine and uh, uh, dairy products. So these are the delicacies here, various types of seeds, anjir barfi and uh, dry fruit jaggery ladu, bundi ladu, and roasted almond ladu. Oh my god, ice cream barfi, kawab mawa barfi, and there are so many pineapple barfi, milk cake, and all these are traditional Indian delicacy sweets, dishes. And uh, this is Marela Pedo, this is Peta. This is uh, it's called uh, strawberry kaji cutli, and ganji uh, roll, all types of strawberry varieties of seeds here. Yeah. And uh, this is uh, this also the section of seeds. Almond rocks, almond rocks. So many varieties. Um, this star roll, you can see. Oh my goodness. And uh, here it is the, here is the ghee section, ghee and butter, I think. This uh, pure ghee, hundred percent pure, and uh, not the duplicate adulterated uh, ones you get in the market. It's hundred percent pure. One thing I want to tell you that I'm not uh, a paid promotion. I'm not doing any paid promotion. Okay, this is uh, popular here. Yeah. That's why. And uh, this is uh, let's see. And uh, the section for various seeds and lessees and uh, 
Various of the India is so beautiful. There are so many varieties of milk and milk products here available. Hundred percent genuine quality. Uh, this ghee, half a liter ghee, I bought from here. This is six hundred and fifty rupees for half a liter. Uh, Twelve hundred and fifty for uh, one liter ghee. And on the way, I see this uh, beautiful Parsi temple. Temple belongs to Parsi community. It's a beautiful structure. It's a temple basically for uh, Parsi community. And um, heading for the and uh, heading to Kalba Devi and uh, this particular street, this particular road is called uh, oh, I forgot that name let me ask this guy what is this road? the road is called what? I don't know, I don't remember what is this road? road is called what? this road is called Pinsiji Road Pinsiji Road Princess Street okay, Princess Street is here Okay, it says all these areas called Princess Street. There's no particular road's name. I've seen one board. And uh, Jagannath Sangha Seth Road or something like that. But generally it's called uh, Princess Street. Okay. It's a beautiful residential buildings here. That's on Nariel Paniwala. Nariel Vendor. Coconut vendor here. That's a common sight everywhere, every street in Mumbai. Uh, okay. Uh, this is uh, strawberry. This is a season for strawberry. And uh, this papai. This one is selling. Fruits like this, cutting the small pieces and uh, selling. And you can buy all fruit also. How much is it? One packet? Yes. Any packet? 15 rupees. Okay. okay. This is 15 rupees per packet. Yeah. Okay. Because right now I'm at this intersection of Cross Road where four roads meet. You can see that board. That road is for uh, Dobitala. I can see that green board. And uh, this one here is for uh, Marine Lines. And this one is for uh, one place called uh, Chila Bazaar. And uh, this road is for Kalba Devi. No, I'm heading to Kalba Devi this way. Okay. And, uh, friends, you can see hundreds of shops uh, all along this walkway. And all types of shops like uh, this one, lottery, voila, lottery guy, and there's a sweet shop, and there are several so many varieties of shops. And on the upper floor, you can see people staying. Uh, all these are residential building, and ground floor, all these uh, business establishments, small, small shops, and uh, various business driving in this area. This is a small uh, mobile accessory shop, like mobile covers and protection glass and all these things. And uh, now heading to Kalba Devi. So pharmacy and uh, mobile shop. And this is uh, one snack corner. It's a snack corner. It's a chai, tea. Okay, let's have some tea right now. It's a time for tea. So I'm gonna have some tea right now. Just one of the snack corner here. There are so many hundreds of snack corner. All this uh, kachori. Hey, kachori, you know? Hey, yeah. is this uh, pakoda? Hey, what is this? Palak Bhaji. 
and uh, this coconut veggie, uh, sorry, potato veggie, and uh, this is uh, vada, uh, samosa, jalebi, kandri vai dhokla, yeah, dhokla, alu vadi, alu vadi, kachori, this, this onion bhaji, kachori, this also kind of kachori, Afra. Okay, thank you. <coughs> and uh, there is one another intersection here. Okay. Uh, this one, the Bank of India building is there. And uh, this one, another intersection. And Kalba Devi area comes to this side, I think. Left side, this one. Okay. I can see the board. Kalba Devi. You can see the road Kalba Devi there, green board. So this is the road leading to Kalba Devi. It was uh, finally made to Kalba Devi market. This is Kalba Devi market. Okay. You can see all this uh, very old, hundreds of years old, age old buildings here, all around this place. Okay. Now, this is not the case in Kalba Devi only. The adjoining areas like uh, Gan Road, Chani Road, Marine Lanes, and uh, when Mohammadali Road, that's also close to Kalba that we get to see such age old buildings. And I'm always wondering why this redevelopment activities are, activities are not happening in these areas. Uh, is this because of heritage status? Heritage status, I'm not sure. I, know, I, I don't think uh, uh, all these buildings in these areas are under heritage status. There are hundreds and thousands of buildings, and uh, I don't think all these buildings are under heritage status. And, but uh, I don't know. I don't know exactly why this uh, redevelopment activities are not happening in this area. But I uh, have to ask somebody. I don't know who to ask. Anyway, I'm heading for the. And uh, this is Kalba Devi Market. There's a small temple in the middle of this road. Now, uh, see Kalba Devi Mandir. It's a small building, small mandir or temple, Hindu temple. Conference now, time is 6.30 p.m. After sunset, this area becomes so vibrant with activities. You can see this is a time for... This is the time people come out for shopping. You can see this huge madding crowd all around. And... Uh, yeah. And uh, one another interesting thing about Kalba Devi is that you get to see small narrow lanes on the sides of this road, main road, and uh, lanes like this, narrow lanes like this, this one, uh, one of the lanes here. And uh, there are several lanes like this on the sides of this road, main road, and each lane dedicated to specific goods and services that is interesting that is the specialty one of the specialty of kalba devi there are hundreds of lanes small narrow lines like this on the sides of this road now oh, i am at uh, one another intersection here or crossroad and uh, and this uh, line goes to bulesha bulesha this this line goes to bulesha market there's a place called Buleshwar and this line leading to Buleshwar and there are several fruit vendors here. Let me ask the rice. Yeah, kit nahi kya Ye kya Huh? This 120 per kilo. And uh, this papai, apple. Apple kit nahi Apple? 300. 200. Ye? Yeah? At 350 per kilo and uh, this one this 100 rupees kilo this mosambi and uh, that's a dragon fruit kitna dragon fruit uh, 250 rupees kilo there are so many types of fruits here 
ये ये ग्रेप्स कितना है भाई दो सौ फोर्टी तो टू हंड्रेड किलो ये ये वाला ये भी टू हंड्रेड ये भी टू हंड्रेड दिस आल्सो टू हंड्रेड स्ट्रॉबेरी स्ट्रॉबेरी वन एटी ओके दिस इस मेलन मेलन कितना मेलन कितने का एटी रुपीस किलो हम लोग ये जगह का वीडियो निकाल रहे हैं This one of the <coughs> fruit vendor here. Thank you. There are several fruit vendors. And see the madding crowd. Bulleshwar Market is popular for <coughs> madding crowd, my dear friends. There are so many items. These things, you get to see everything under the sun here. Everything under the sun. This is Bulesha. So get to see all these ready-made outfits like pants, trousers. And uh, this blankets, pillow covers, and uh, what is this blankets and the trousers, and uh, track pants, and all uh, the t-shirts, and uh, all lot of things. Yeah, this is Bulleshwar Market. Sir, what are you doing, boy? Two hundred and fifty. ढाई सौ रुपया सब एक ही रेट है क्या टू फिफ्टी एंड ये टी शर्ट टी शर्ट कितने का आएगा टू हंड्रेड रुपीज सब एक ही रेट है ओके ट्रॉली विच लाइन डेडिकेटेड टू डिफरेंट गुड्स एंड सर्विसेज एंड दिस लाइन इज फॉर ऑल दिस थिंग्स लाइक दिस एंड All this jewelry and uh, you know there are several imitation jewelry shops in in this line. All this imitation jewelry. Okay, you can see. <laughs> That's interesting. This is nice. Yeah, how much, boy? Fifty rupees. Okay. See the crowd, <laughs> and uh, one other interesting thing here is that uh, something like this is a hand cart <laughs> that is found everywhere in this area. You see this hand cart. Now, friends, I want to show you something very interesting. I am in this place called uh, Lohar Chal, next to Crawford Market. You can see all these decorative items, especially for Christmas and New Year. All these candles, artificial candles, and the flowers. All these artificial flowers, you know, it's very interesting. Since the Christmas and New Year is around the corner, you get to see things like this here. This is normal. Every year you get to see. It's very beautiful. This is not original candle, but uh, artificial candles. Yeah. So beautiful. Yeah, all these are for Christmas and New Year. You can see Christmas tree. This is Christmas trees, and uh, so so beautiful, amazing. And this also Christmas trees here. All these are for Christmas and New Year. See so many Christmas trees and flowers, and all these are artificial, not original. See this one, amazing. All these trees you get to see. The streets full of. Things like this, so beautiful. How amazing and beautiful it is! So again, this. Uh, 
candles, artificial candles. This is not a original flame. It's electric flame. Okay. So oh, many flower wonders. So beautiful. All these are from, remember all these are from China. <laughs> China is popular for things like this. Yeah. These are Chinese products. 100%. So beautiful. See? All these flowers. Looks so original. It's very looking original flowers. Okay. Here. All this is full of things like this. The flowers and uh, Christmas trees and all types of decorative items for Christmas and New Year. See how amazing it is. This you get to see every year. There is a specialty of Lohat Chal. And uh, so beautiful. And uh, here is uh, our Santa Claus. At first, I believe you now this is enough for today. Okay, and I'll be back soon with some of the content. Now heading to CSC session. It's very close by, and uh, yeah. Uh, I'll be back with some of the interesting content. Till then, goodbye. If you like the video, watch till end. Subscribe, share and like. Thanks for watching. Thank you so much.